slash 45. This is a 9,000 pound lifting capacity, 45 foot reaching capacity telehandler. This is the same thing as a as a great as a JLG. JLG and Gradle are the same machine. So uh, anyway, what we're going to do in this first clip is we're going to talk about the mechanics of this particular machine first, and then we'll talk about the operating spec second, and then we'll run the machine in the third clip. Price on a new machine like this these days is, um, I don't even know, it's well over $100,000. Um, this machine has got 1,143 hours on it. Now, it will accumulate hours because we do occasionally use it here on the yard. Not a whole lot, but we do use it. Uh, this machine, as far as manufacturers go, JLG slash Gradol is they're one of the top manufacturers of uh, aerial equipment in the world, bar none. This machine weighs 25,250 pounds. The widest point of those tires there at 8 foot 1 inches. The tallest point is the top of this uh, cab over here, which is 8 feet. The transportation link from the end of the counterweight to the front of the fork face is 20 feet. And then it's uh, 24 feet to the end tip, tip of the fork. Uh, JLG renamed this, uh, now they're calling them 943s. As far as the history of this unit goes, this machine, like almost every machine we purchase, is an original owner Dallas, Texas machine. I say that because there is no rust on this machine. I mean, on the fork face, you'll see where, uh, you know, where, uh, where the paint's rubbed off and the rainwater's gotten clipped, but it in no way, shape, or form is rust pervasive. We're 300 miles from the ocean, and we're far enough south that the only salt we see is the salt on our kitchen tables. Um, this particular telehandler came from a company that had an excellent maintenance program that rivaled some of the best I've seen. We've been happy with all the machines that we purchased from these guys, and it should be said that before I purchase any machine, I have two mechanics go out and inspect it. If they say everything's okay, then Pro goes out and inspects it. And if he says everything's okay, then I personally go out and inspect it before I write a check. As far as... Uh, the engine goes, this is a Cummins turbocharged four-cylinder diesel engine, same engine that they got in the JLGs today. Uh, this fuel tank here is, uh, oh, this is a fuel tank. It's a diesel tank. It, it's probably about a, uh, I don't know, maybe a 50-gallon a tank. It'll run you anywhere from 18 to 24 hours of operation. It, they're, they're pretty efficient on fuel. All of the fluid levels on this tractor are where they should be. This machine is mechanically sound. Everything on it works. There's no cracks or welds anywhere in the work equipment. The transmission propels just fine. It is a four-wheel drive machine. Top speed is 18 miles an hour. Pro actually drove this uh, it was on the other side of town, and uh, he drove it uh, about 14 miles to get it here. So it's uh, he didn't break any land speed records, but he got it here okay. Um, this is a hydrostatic drive machine. Okay, now you got a switch here that switches from four wheel drive to two wheel drive. Now at two wheel drive, your top speed's only uh, six miles an hour. I'm sorry, on four wheel drive, it's six miles an hour. And then on two wheel drive, it's 18 miles an hour. You can see these tires are in really good shape. They are solid tires. In other words, there's no air in those tires. They're solid foam filled tires. The tires, if you were to average them out, are about 95%. There's no cuts on them. Back in the back, they're brand new. And then those in the front are not that new. Um, as far as things wrong with this machine, I can't think of a single thing wrong. How about you, folks? 
Yeah. No, I can't. You're not just saying that, are you? No, I drove it a long way, so I know. <laughs> he did drive it a long way. Um, like I say, the maximum reach on this is 45 feet. These forks right here are four foot forks. The carriage width is five foot seven inches wide. The carriage height, I'm sorry, the carriage width is three foot nine inches. The carriage height is five foot seven inches. So uh, I think that's about it, unless Pro has something else he wants to say. No, you got it covered. Okay, we're gonna run it in the next clip. Let's get it, huh? it, it got dark. All right, so this is a serial number of the machine is uh, 064470. It says it weighs 25,740 pounds. There's your hour meter right there. All the gauges work. There's your seat. It's a good running machine. That's where you check your oil right there.